So we're going to be we're checking out Buzz Marine, Indian Lake, Ohio for the Indian Lake Boat Show. March the 7th after lunchtime. We're at Buzz Marine out on the corner of Indian Lake. They have these, I'm not sure if this is a trash receptacle, no? It has a compass I think, but for deep sea diving. So they have some vintage in here. Some art. There's another one over here. Check out the boats, some hot deals on boats, some sold boats. So the boat dealers opened up their showrooms. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe it's for underwater compass? That one said Neptune on the other one. It's pretty neat, isn't it? So some something made out of brass that and oh and a little window over here too or for a hose. It looks like it's from the movie, so we're going to step up here to get a better vantage point. This one showroom is like a grocery store with parts everywhere. And there's two tents with boats and then just massive quantity of boats stored outdoors that you can just see driving by. So there's, there's a vintage how boys are laying down on their sides. These ones are on a stand. 1937, wow. Johnson Seahorse. Quite a gear thing there. And a little lobster thing. That would be for the ocean. I wonder if they use those on the fresh water. Yeah, love my vintage. This new stuff's pretty serious. See what we run into back here, some king rope. It's all pri oh there's one of them deep sea tank things too, the yellow. I wonder if that's for a display or they they really use something like that for fishing for on the corner of your boat. I need an oar. For a paddle, I mean. Which I have one, it's just pretty wore out. Dickie Pope Jr., three time national champ. Some wooden, um, a pair of wooden skis. Oh, this is cool. Something off a ship over here, vintage. Serious. From damn. Sometimes I just go to the antique mall in Springfield and walk around yeah. filming all the antiques. Yeah. And on a winter day. Oh wow, look at this one. That is so cool. I suppose that was actually used too. I mean, that's the real thing right there, guys. This is not repop. Don't ask, I don't know. Make our way around here real quick. The boat show, any lake, buds. Oh wow. Garages everywhere, stuff outdoors. There's a Honda engine. We gotta see Honda today. Alright, Honda Power Sports. There's a Honda transmission plant right across there. Oh wow, we hit the gold mine of vintage outboards. I was seeing pictures of this on his um, Google. Got to see it in person. It looks like one of each too. There's some Johnson, Everage. Uh, a paddleboard, inflatable paddleboard man. Possibly inflatable. I, for 300 bucks, stand up, inflatable, 10 foot 6. A Minnecota, some of the, a little Minnecota display on the end. Seahorse. Yeah, no two the same. They're all different looking, aren't they? The gold one. Nice display.
not sure this is like a veneer um, wood that you find floating in the lake converted into art yeah paddle boards uh, I'm not sure do you pull them behind your boat and float on them or something this one has the hood off I was always intimidated by what these engines look like when someone would ask for a tune up I was like yeah I don't think so the spark plugs are in there the quail packs you think computer and walking around some show models digging that TV set thing it's like a grocery store with all your uh, additives lubricants filters humongous NGKs instrumentation customization accessories just a quick walk around to get an idea is all we're going to and I don't know one end up from the other much more than I do already but so it's been a rough day out here it's blowing a tent around they have this lock now we're, we're in um, this part and we'll walk around the other because I noticed there's a rope right there and a pump big circus tent here with the luxurious models this one's into the six figures 23 sold 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 Sylvian S-Y-L where you can spell Sylvia S-I but S-Y-L oh wow this is this is a very sexy unit here check out the teardrop looking engine when it's in that position anyway yeah and I'm um, probably the biggest sexiest Mercury engine I've ever seen called a Verado or something Yeah, I come here on a Monday after lunch because there's not going to be the crowds of people or anyone. Be discreet about it. Just to get an idea. I've never been to the Indian Lake Boat Show, so... It took me till 2022 and we're in shallow anchor system. For 80 bucks. Tell I'll twist anchor. Well, something like that would be nice for my canoe. And take the dog out. There's another one of those, a Fernando uh, outboard engines for Mercury. Beautiful brass piece here. Made in New Jersey. Elizabeth. And then it says, this says New York, but it said Elizabeth, New Jersey up there. Beacon, New York. Hadn't heard of that, but yeah, Elizabeth is right there. Union County. I delivered to their courthouse before. Newark, New Jersey. Um, another one of those huge TV sets. I'm going to walk up here. That's a pretty large um, unit there. 114.5 350 horse mercury outboard engine who would have thought sold 350 horsepower my god check it out Some beautiful pontoons. It's a little maze in here. Check out some Suzuki's if we can. Back and forth real quick. 
We're into another circus tent now. The Quest. I thought this one was cute. And it doesn't say sold on it. It's it's the smaller one. At 27 now. So. I was thinking it was less than that. Or I could I could have it mixed up with. Because I've seen so many. Um, it's kind of interesting the seating on the back of this one. Or in the front, I mean, I'm sorry. This kind of reminds me of a Buick. Or maybe even an Audi. Beautiful colors. This one has a green, a nuclear green. But I wanted to show these little Luns over here. I don't see prizes on them. But these are available. And a 14 footer. It looks big almost. Uh, here we go in back into this tent from the other direction real quick. This one's a 75.6. Manitou. I wonder what that means. Manitou. Sounds like California. Sounds like a town. Sounds like a town by Malibu or something. This Sylvian has a Suzuki step on it. That's pretty cool. Mirage. A20. Sylvian. They're, they're too wide in here. Over here. Up here. Just want to say there's one up here. I've heard the name before. Got a complimentary map of the Indian Lake here from them. It's pretty detailed. A little brochure coming handy. Haven't been up here for a couple years, kicking the tires. It's a place to be in the summer. I wonder why you would need a garment on a boat, but this has it. I mean. Turn left, and I don't know. But this is a um, this is an older name that this is still in production. The the Star Craft, and there was Chris Craft. Get them mixed up. Um, this looks like a professional skiing boat or something. I'm not sure. Check it out, the Starcraft. You know, that might scare you what that thing's cost, a Starcraft. But there's one, a brand new Starcraft. Available here at Indian Lake, Ohio. Thanks for, thanks for watching, everyone. I'm going to repeat Bud's Marine uh, for the Indian Lake Boat Show. Length with that doesn't include an engine, I don't think. No, it says 20 horsepower, 200 horsepower. I'm sorry, you get a 200 horse for that price. Right off the bat, pretty open floor plan in there. Yep, thanks again. Enjoy your summer.